Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. A couple of weeks ago, uh, one of my colleagues at work was asking me, like, how, how do they know when someone's reaching an age or retirement or whatever it is, and how they figure out when they should maybe consider you for an award like this? And I think the simple answer is, I would first like to congratulate all the inductees tonight. To be in a crowd like this is really special for someone like myself. And all you athletes should be extremely proud of the accomplishments you've had over the years. I'm very excited and humbled to have my name mentioned along with all these great athletes. Back in the day when I first started curling, curling wasn't really considered to be someone that was an athlete, so it's quite special to be up here. My sincere thanks go to the induction committee for awarding me this great honor. I feel a little hesitant being honored as an individual curler because as we all know, curling is a team sport. I've been very fortunate to have curled with a number of great curlers over the last 30 plus years. It's actually a little more than that, but. <laughs> a lot of recognition and the reason for me standing here today should go out to them for allowing me to be part of some very special moments and for sharing those achievements with me. I would like to take this opportunity to say a few thank yous to some of those people who were instrumental in the curling successes I was so fortunate to have. First of all, I need to thank all the great people from Assiniboine Memorial Curling Club. They have supported me all the way back to my early days as a junior curler and throughout my entire career. I'm very proud to say that I might be the only competitive curler out there who has been a member of only one curling club from start to finish. And I'm also very proud that my daughters are continuing this tradition so far and hope that they will experience the same pride in being members of Cinnaboyne Memorial. I have been lucky enough to have played with a number of world-class curlers during my curling career. They have all been instrumental in the accomplishments I've had, but there are three teammates in particular who have had a significant influence on me standing up here tonight and I would like to personally thank them right now. Keith Fenton, Rob Meekin, and Jeff Ryan. Four of us curled together at the highest level as a team for eight years. Now very few teams on that level have ever been able to boast that kind of longevity, which is something I'm quite proud of. We competed fiercely, we laughed often, and we also partied hardy. <laughs> we created some amazing memories that will last forever in my mind, many of which, of which were late nights at the keg. Those eight years were the highlight of my curling career. My two biggest fans from the start of my career have been my parents, Jean and Loretta Burtnick. Their unconditional support of everything I did over the years allowed me to have the opportunity to become a better curler. I will never be able to thank them enough for giving me the chance to play this great game. Thank you, Mom and Dad. And last, but certainly not least, I need to thank my wife, Patty, and my two daughters, Rachel and Laura. You have supported me every step of the way through thick and thin. Some of you might be quite surprised to find out that I can be a little tough to live with at times. <laughs> the three of you have had to make a lot of sacrifices over the years in order to allow me to be away from home so much in order to compete. Not only did you never complain, and I mean never, but you encouraged me to continue even when times were tough, and there were a few of those. You are my whole world, and I love you very much. I also need to mention one more thing that is a little off topic tonight. One of my fellow competitors for many years, and also someone I consider a friend, Vic Peters, is currently battling cancer. 
I think I can speak for the whole Curling community in saying our thoughts and prayers are with Vic and his family, and we wish them all the best in this fight. Thank you.